Hi, in this video I want to explain you how to memorize using mnemonic techniques which basis makes two and which makes uh, three bonds. And uh, I believe that after this video you would remember it once and forever because this is very very easy. So we have four bases and this is adenine that base pairs with um, thymine and we have cytosine that base pairs with guanine. But probably you, just like me, a uh, few years ago, uh, have the same problem memorizing uh, which bases makes double bond and which makes triple bond. And actually this is very easy. Uh, the question itself contains the answer to this question. Uh, here is the uh, word that stands for the two bonds and the first letter T uh, you have to memorize. It's like uh, you can also say the two sounds like T and U. So T or Zymin would make a uh, double bond and U that would stand for the uracil also would make a uh, double bond and uh, uracil we can find in message RNA and thymine would be substituted with uracil. So here we have double bond and this automatically means that uh, cytosine and guanine have triple bond. And here is a picture and as you see on this picture guanine and cytosine have triple bond and thymine and adenine have double bond. So as you see this is very easy technique and of course this refers to the DNA and in the message RNA we have adenine and instead of zymine uracil double bond and cytosine triple bond with guanine and this is what we have in message RNA. And you may wonder why message RNA has double and triple, triple bonds because message RNA is single stranded. But uh, actually, message RNA uh, falls on itself and makes a three dimensional structure. And maybe you remember this picture from your textbooks of the tRNA that looks like this. So this is RNA, it falls on itself and uh, where it is adenine and uracil it has double bond and whenever it is uh, has cytosine and guanine it has triple bond. So this is all for today, thank you for your attention. Now I hope you would be able to answer this question uh, correctly on your exam and please write your comments, questions if you have any and see you in the next video. Goodbye.